guys so I'm gonna show you some of the tools I'm gonna to be using with the boys this summer I want to thank Jeffrey's teacher because she did all of this for the kids and some of them I do have duplicates because she had extras and sent them home so Robert has his own too so it's really great so let me turn you around and show you all right so as you can see we have a ton of stuff um, so over here we have these little cards and they have a shape and then they have to match them. You can either use the clip or you could just point to it. I'm going to like try to use both. Um, but I have two of those, which is great because these, a couple of these will be able to do together. Like I said, I have duplicates. Uh, this is what Jeffrey had to do every morning at school. So, um, she sent it home because obviously it's for him. Um, I'm probably going to do one for Robert too. Um, it won't be that hard to do. Um, we also have this. It's actually just, it's from Christmas time. It was one of those Christmas activities, but it has the little, um, the little letters. There's uppercase and lowercase. So I thought that would be fun. I kept that because I thought that'd be awesome for them. Um, and then we have these two. It's you count the little picture and then you go to what the number is. So that is really cool. We have two of those also. Um, and then we have these little mats that are actually for Play-Doh, which is awesome because I was gonna make these. Um, so you can like make Play-Doh to, you know, do the number and then you can use sprinkles too to put on the cupcake. So there's just so many things we can do with this, which is awesome. Um, so we have a bunch of these. She did them up to 10, which is great. Um, this is Jeffrey's name, which is, I'm going to do one for Robert too. Um, but this just spells out Jeffrey so he can put them in order. Um, these are colors and those like pictures that go with the colors. Um, so we're going to work on those. Jeffrey does know those colors, but it's just doing the shapes too. So that'll be fun. Um, these are just a bunch of letters so the boys can identify upper and lower case. Um, we also have a um, puzzle too that I'll show you in another video. But um, So this will be great. So this is the upper and lower case. These are just identifying shapes pictures, which is fun. So like they can see that that's a robot. They can learn what the word is also. This is, it shows a picture and then it's got the lower case letter on the left. Oops, sorry this a little better the lowercase and then you have to find the uppercase which is really cool um, then there's a couple of little books that they can color and we can read so that'll be fun um, this is actually ours these is just a bunch of flashcards I have object pictures um, then I have just letters and then we have numbers too so that's great um, we've been collecting those over the last year um, and then these are also the same. It's, you know, you count the picture and then you, you know, pick which one is the correct number. So this will be good. But we ended up with two. They're actually, they're kind of the same, but they're different. Um, as you can see, like this one is horizontal and this one's vertical. So that'll be good because, again, it'll be one of those that we can do together. Each boy can have their own. Um, so those are all the fun activities that I've got here that his teacher made so this is um it's gonna be fun we're gonna have a lot of fun and i i'm gonna try to record while we're doing it sometimes so i can show you guys like how they do and how they work um but yeah this is just again just some of the tools we're gonna be using